Whitefish Mountain Resort opened last week, but they celebrated their official 70th birthday today, honoring the families of those who opened the resort back in 1947. MTN's Jack Ginsburg shows us why the day is important to them and the community. On December 14, 1947, Ed Shank, George Prentice, and Lloyd Muldown, with the help of many others, opened Big Mountain to the public. There were donuts and coffee to welcome skiers to the mountain before they took the 3,200-foot T-bar to the top. A lift ticket was only $2, and a burger ran you 25 cents. And Thursday, 70 years later, Whitefish Mountain Resort unveiled a new plaque next to Chair One to recognize the three men who opened the mountain and made it what it is today. Just like back in 1947, there were donuts and coffee for skiers and snowboarders. Both Ed and George's sons were there to see the presentation of the plaque. To see it actually up and displayed was, you know, pretty special. And I know my dad would have been extremely proud of that. Oh, I think it was great. It, it let people know around here what, how the mountain started and how it became what it is today. Both Shank and Prentice shared some of their first memories here on Big Mountain. And we'd sat in the back of our old Pontiac coming up. We didn't have seats in the back. And my sister and I would be looking out the window waiting until we, you know, saw the lodge and we'd both be yelling, I see the Skeely Lodge, you know. And, and then the T-bar, I was so small that I had to ride with a tall person and they had to put it behind their ankles to <laughs> accommodate my, my shortness. <laughs> the Prentice family moved to New Jersey when Thomas was in third grade, but he remembers hearing his dad always talking about wanting to move back to Whitefish. I'd see the sparkle in his eye, I'd see how passionate he was about, yeah. about the whole thing up here, you know. And Thomas says that some of his father's words stuck with him forever. I think that talk for one thing got me thinking even when I was from third grade through high school that Man, as soon as I graduate, I'm going to Montana. I'm going back to Montana, you know. And that's just what he did. Prentice has been here on and off doing various jobs for years. Anything from a ski patroller in winter to a cook in the summer, carrying on his father's legacy. In Whitefish, Jack Ginsburg, MTN News.